Hey guys, welcome back. Today is day 12 of my uh, Christmas horror challenge and today we're going to talk about a weird one from 2018 and that is called Await Further Instructions. Uh, this is a film by Johnny Kevorkian. Kind of a weird last name to have, don't you think? Um, so it says it's a smart sci-fi horror. Sci-fi horror, yes. Smart. Yeah, yo, if you've seen it, you you know what I mean. So, this movie, here, here's the synopsis. It's Christmas Day, and the Milgram family wake to find a mysterious black substance surrounding their house. Something monumental is clearly happening right outside their door, but what exactly? An industrial accident? A terrorist attack? Nuclear war? Descending into terrified arguments, they turn on the television to desperate for any information on screen a message glows ominously ominously stay indoors and await further instructions as the television exerts an every more sinister grip their paranoia escalates into bloody carnage a powder keg of throat grabbing intensity and mind bending body horror await further instructions as as unmissable tour de force from rising star filmmaker Johnny Kevorkian and the BAFTA nominated producer of God's Own Country. So it's been a little while since I've seen this, um, but I do remember thinking it was just all right. Uh, kind of kind of weird. Uh, they're basically stuck in the house. They can't get out. Um, and if they try to get out, there are consequences. Uh, I'll leave it at that so you guys can watch it for yourselves. Uh, but body horror, body horror, yeah, it's kind of, yeah, it's got some body horror in here, if you guys like that kind of thing. Uh, special features, you get interviews on here, storyboards, concept art, and the trailer. It's 91 minutes, it's not rated. And yeah, if you like movies that take place in one setting, you'll probably enjoy it. Um, I, like I said, I thought it was okay. Uh, nothing much inside, just, just the same artwork on the disc. This is put up by Dark Sky Films. You can, I think it's still available online. You know, you can check Amazon, eBay, uh, what are other other um, places like? Honestly, you can't buy this in store. I bought it on Amazon a couple of years ago to add it to my Christmas horror collection. It's also it's also put up by Shutter Films. Which I don't think is the same as the other shutter because this, yeah, it says right there, shutter films, but it's a different logo, so I don't know. All right, guys, hope you enjoyed my little synopsis about this this very strange movie, but check it out, and I'll catch you guys tomorrow for day thirteen. See you later, guys.